Heathrow Immigration Removal Centre. And obviously the sign's a bit... that it's uh, HMS Central Service. And obviously with all the immigrants and people, um, asylum seekers, they will be based here, guys. Lord of Audits in front, guys. Do go and subscribe to him. I will put his link in the description. And the thing is, guys, because we're right on the borders with Terminal 5 Airport, which is literally just there, like, you got to be careful with the bylaws and stuff, but we're all good here, guys. And um, we're all on the public footpath. Um, and here we go, look. There's their little vans. Let they uh, get them in. So, uh, just like a prison, guys. There's their gate, look, you come out of. Literally looks like a prison. See their little vans, look? Yeah, I was just pointing out that one there. It's all an MOT failure. For the state of it? Yeah, it's got <laughs> sharp bits on the outside. Fucking hell. Sorry for swearing, guys. That's ridiculous. Just yeah. sticks their hand out in a push chair or whatever. And catch yeah. Sharp bits. Put his hand up. It looks like a prison lord, doesn't it? It does, yeah. Looks like HMP the mount. So, so we've got one just uh, sat in the motor there. So it's Mike Care and Custody then. Their little um, firm there. That's uh, one of their vans, guys. Isn't it? Nice little grounds though, looks like they're looking after it. <laughs> Sorry, oh, it's so windy guys. Sorry if the wind's bad. But yeah, that looks like a back gate guys, the prison. Smoking area. Sort of like a little kitchen there. It's all a public footpath here, look. It's beautiful. No, it is for sure. Here we go. Sorry? Who are you? Who are you? You want to talk to us? I don't want to talk to you. Who said we can't record here then? Yeah, who said it? Yeah? Okay, no worries. Thank you, mate. Have a good day. Come on, slam the door and all. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we're on public land here. As you can see. Obviously, you can't have a fag here. It's got beeping in the van. Look how close some planes are, guys. Sorry if the light is bad, guys. This is a backup phone. Um, yeah, I'm just going to walk you around the ground a little bit more, guys. As you, as you heard the guy say, he's going to call the police. Let me pick this back up, guys. Just pick this back up, guys. Sorry, it's very windy. We've had a van there beeping us already. We've got panic stations at the door. And obviously we are on a public, public footpath. How are we doing? There you go, a couple of guys there respecting our rights to film. Which is good. Panic stations and pendulum. This is the staff entrance here. They're just going in. Sorry guys, this quality is going to be bad. This is backup phone. Yeah, they're panicking in here, Lord. Cup of tea. What's their problem? This is public land. This is a high security area. Just like that. No entry to that. That is entry guys. Doors open. It literally is as well. All I was doing, Lord, was reading this sign. 
It doesn't say anything about filming, does it? No. It's just about alcohol. Alcohol and conveying um, things. Your the attention of conveying things to. I keep, I keep bibbing us. Your attention is drawn to the following extract for immigration and asylum act 1999. So that was 23 years old. There's no, there's no signs here about filming. Um, this is obviously public land, it's a public footpath. There's a barrier there for cars, but obviously we come on. The, uh, the footpath way. The people in the van keep bibbing us. I don't know what that's about. But yeah, a guy did come out. Guys, I'm going to put Lord of Order's link in the description. Yeah, like I said, guys, a guy did come out, but um, look at that little, little crocodile, isn't it? A sick little thing. Little turtle. Did you get that? Yeah. Uh, security. Do you know what though, being serious, if they don't want the public to come here, Sorry. why is there markings on the on the floor like that for yeah. public? Yeah. Um, we haven't crossed any barriers, we've literally followed the footpath, haven't we? Yeah, yeah, from the main road. Yeah, I'm gonna show the people. I think the police are gonna come, mate, to be honest with you. Yeah, guys, literally, I'm just gonna walk you to the road we've been on. It's all put, uh, footpath. Sorry, guys, the quality is bad. Look, guys, everything we've followed is to the T. So, we're all good, guys. I think they're, I think they're just a bit shot. I don't think it's been filmed, guys. To be honest with you, here. Yeah. I know AB was not too far from here. I did a brief video, but I don't think he actually did this place. They don't want to be on camera, look. Ah. For me, mate, yeah, all the prison I've been in, that looks like a prison back gate. Yeah. So, yeah, it's calling the police apparently. Guys, I'm just going to wait here for the police. Hey guys, just picking it back up at uh, Heathrow Immigration Centre. Hi, guys. Hello. Um, we no. Off. Well, where's the signs to say it's private property? Oh, this is Crown Site. Yeah, but you know a Crown Site and a prison site is owned by the public? And this is Crown property. Yeah, but Crown property is the same thing, because this is a public footpath. It's not. Well, of course it is. You can be at the front of the main road. Why is there markings cannot, on the floor then? You cannot come this way, I'm afraid. But why is there markings on the floor? What are you here for? It doesn't matter, does it? We, we have the right to ask you, you're actually on private property. It's not we private property. Well, it would be nice for us to know, what's the intention, why are you here? Being nice and thinking, it is what it is, isn't it? Um, we're, we're allowed to film, we're in public land. It's not we're going to have to ask you to leave, or we'll have to contact the police. You can contact the police, no okay. problem. Can you kindly make your way? Back? No, because you're threatening us with the police, so if you're going to call the police, call the police. We'll and we'll wait here for them, because there's obviously a police station just up the road. But you are, you're saying, if we don't move, you're going to get the police. We're not on crime property. Where's the sign saying crime There's no signs. It's public land. So get the police if you're going to get the police. No, you get the police, we'll wait for the police. Yeah, but it doesn't matter what you say. We, we're doing what we're doing. But can you, can you tell us what's the nature of why you're here then? Well, what is it here? Clearly, what? clearly we're filming a place. What's this called here? Immigration Centre? Yeah. So that's what we're filming, aren't we? For what purpose? It doesn't matter. Why we're just purpose? filming. Yeah. We don't even know who you are. What are you, anyway? We're working security. Okay. Well, we don't know who you are. It doesn't matter. Like you said, you're going to get the police, so we'll wait for the police. We'll have respect for them. There's only a police station over there, so we'll wait for the police. And they will tell you we're allowed to do this, and that's, that's how it goes. You're not allowed to do We'll it. get the police and we'll see them, yeah? And we'll wait here for them. Yeah, that's That's exactly right. We'll wait. We'll have respect for the police and wait. Get on the radio. Call the police. There's no signs. This is public land. Where's the signs for private land? 
absolutely ridiculous. You shouldn't have to go through this for just filming. That's the only signs you've got here, guys. Like I said to the lady, call the police. The police are literally around the corner. It's public land. Call the police. And they'll do exactly, and tell us exactly what we're doing. It's, it's perfect. It's legal. Imita they're trying intimidation, uh, what, intimidation yeah, tactics. Yeah, that's, of course they are. that's all it is. Um, no. Nah. They can't physically remove us anyway, and it's public land. Oh look, he's filming us, look, that's breach of GDPR there. There we go guys. Just took a picture of us, look, that's breach of GDPR. Obviously he's in work. Did you that... just take a photo of us? That's not good, We're gonna request that, you know. Look at him, he's a fake little police officer, look. There we go. Smile for the camera. That's a disgrace. Ignorance. There's no need for that, is there? I'm scared now because he's gonna lose it. It's over. <laughs> pendulum, guys. Absolute pendulum here. Especially we don't even know who he is. They could ask us who we are, but as soon as we ask him a question, he walks off. At least we've standed here and waited. Yeah. That's the problem. When you're in work, it's GDPR regulations, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, this is the first guy that said about calling the police. It's, it's, it's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. I'm going to ask this guy who he is. Excuse me, mate. Do you know you taking a photo? We're going to request that. Who are you anyway? Why are you not talking? That's a disgrace. Takes a photo of us and looks off. What's he doing? What the hell is going on? What's he doing? What's up, with, what's up with him then? He just ran off. I only asked him like who he is because obviously he's got taken photos of us probably on a work phone. Yeah. Um, it's breach of GDPR, that is. But what company is this? Do we know? No. I think it's on this landlord. What company they are? Care and custody, look. They are. Yeah. So this is their company, guys. That's their little sign. We're going to have a check of them after. Alright, guys, I'll pick this back up. Hello? Sorry? I thought it was state. This is state. Public footpath? Look at the markings on the road. Cheers, mate. We know what we're doing. Don't bother talking to them. We're just public auditors. We're waiting for the police to come back. What are we? Public auditors. Public auditors. How long are the police going to be then? Excuse me. That's too much. No, because he just said you not to talk to us. We can talk, mate. It's, it's free land. This is the land of the free. You can't tell me what to do. I'm not telling you what to do. Yes, you are. Clear off him. See you later. We don't need anything to do with you, boss. Have a good day. Have a lovely day. Have a lovely and enjoy the sun. I'm on the road. This is real life. This is not pretend. This is real life. So we're public officers, apparently, Lord. I'll wait for the police, mate, but they take it. They're literally there. Excuse me, mate. How long till the police are here? 
Excuse me, mate. How long to the police are at? Oh, mate. You're pissing me off. Sorry about swearing, guys. Yeah, guys, I'm going to put all the water's link in the description. Do check him out. Um, we're literally at Pendulum at the minute in this place. Um, they're all panicking. They've called the police. We're having people telling us what to do, left, right and centre. We just had a bald guy come out and say they're public auditors. Um, turn your cameras on. There was a guy uh, taking pictures of me and Lord, which is a breach of GDPR. So that's that's where we're at at the minute, guys. Um, they, they, they're kind of putting us on the standoff. They're all, we're all just waiting for the police. Uh, me and Lord are in public land. They did come out and say we can film, but from the uh, outside. But it's all public land, guys. So I'm just going to come over to Lord and see what he's doing. Is he not speaking? So this is the guy that said about public auditors, yeah? I'll tell you, mate, they're getting um, educated, aren't they? Yep. There's a guy, look, the ignorant yeah, guy. The I'm sick of get, trying to get told what to do, though, isn't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Fully grown men, in public land. Literally in public land. Makes me laugh, Lord. All of this with the bad phone. <laughs> the quality's gonna be but Oh, look at the gate. Got the gate open. That is a prison gate, I swear to God, Lord. Hello, guys. There's the guy who tried busting us about that one. The other, the other one's parked up there, I think. I think they might be transferring people. Or... There's the gate, guys. Five minutes already, and the police is only around there. There's another one, guys. Tyranny. Tyranny is clear here, isn't it? They won't answer a question, Lord. Like, how long will the police be? They're literally around the corner. Turn their cameras on as well, Lord. How long till the police are here then? If you answer us, then we move on. It's simple, isn't it? How long till the police are here? Have you been told not to speak to us now? By Mr. Baldy. I think Mr. Baldy was the boss. Yeah. Awesome. Oh. It's just pointless, Lord. They're not even talking, mate. No. Absolute disgrace. Oh, well, the longer the police take, the longer we'll be here, then, won't we? Morning. Morning. Oh, yeah, how are you? Right. Yeah, yeah good, thank you. Have a lovely day. Very polite people, very nice. So you get an interaction like that, you speak to me, you don't mind talking to the police, do you? That's exactly right. I think he's on the phone to the police guys, but they're not answering our questions. Um, so yeah, we're still waiting. I think we're nearly here half an hour, guys. So, I think it's me and all the waters, we've got more places to do. I'm sorry guys if this quality is bad. It's on the spare phone. 
I do apologise, but I can only try my best with what I've got. And guys, while we're here, can we hit 5k? We're 86 subscribers away while I'm recording this video. So can we make it? Very, very windy, guys. It's affecting the air. Yeah, it's pendulum, guys. It's only the first, there's loads of um, part of this detention centre as well, all the way around there. And uh, they've got a more secure fence there. And we've only literally just gone to the front bit here. As you can see, Lord's just walking up down there. me guys that looks purely like a prison from my memories of jail um, we've got the barbed wire there guys as well so yeah we've only walked the first part the police station's literally five minutes away and uh, they called the police what 20 25 minutes ago so I do not think the police are coming guys I'm gonna pick this back up when they do if they do respect Picking this back up guys, we're still in the immigration centre in Heathrow, still with Lord of Audits, check him out, I'll put his link in the description. We're currently at Cowboy Standoff, we're waiting for the police. Um, the police are literally five minutes away here, you have Polar Park Police Station, we're still in Heathrow. Uh, we have been here over half an hour waiting for these police. Like I said, we've got a Mexican standoff, they're literally over here guys, they got the cameras on, panicking, wouldn't answer any questions. We're not saying to them about like once the police come in. And uh, yeah, this is the uh, oh, the visitor centre here. Eh? So this is uh, part of the visitor centre, guys. It's a mad old place. It's a massive building. Um, listen, guys, I'm sorry. I, I don't know a million things about the place, um, but. It's a mad old place, guys. I think this is uh, it's the front gate here, guys. Oh, I see Hansworth. Drug detection dogs in operation, look. Mad old place. Monstrous. So yeah, it is a visit center, guys. Like I said, we're still on the Mexican standoff. Um, they called the place. Um, I've been waiting. So yeah, that's where we're at. A lot of these places, guys, around this bit here, all the doors are open. Another door open. So this is where you'll be visiting the people that are in there. Just like a prison little setup look, but they left the door open there, guys. So the minute you go in there at all, that then becomes illegal, yeah? Well, if the door's open, technically you can. Um, it's just if you step in there, isn't it? You can walk all around there, Lord. That's a, it's a mad old place, isn't it? Rubbish. Oh, it stinks, man. I'm gonna get a little bit of this. I'm gonna go get these again. I think this is the front gate, Lord. Yeah, look, guys. We still got a Mexican standoff. They're still over here watching us. Let's take it round. Yeah, guys. So, um, as I said, we're very close to 5k. I know I do mention it a lot, but please do subscribe if you haven't, guys. It really helps. And uh, we can finally achieve them goals, guys. But yeah, we're still on the Mexican standoff, guys. We're trying to bully us off the premises. We're still waiting on the police. Um, and yeah, that's about it, guys. Pick up Gypsy Town, Pumbrook. Yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah, right, mate. 
It's a little standoff, guys. It's an excellent standoff. And the guy down the bottom there, guys, if you can see him just over there, this was the one that took uh, me and Lord of Audit's uh, photo. Um, and it was ignoring us. And I was trying to say to him about breach of GDPR. Um, but you know, that's the tyrant you've got to deal with on public land. So this is what it is, isn't it? Good old Mexican standoff, Lord. There's no place, mate. Wasting our time pretending to call the police. Ridiculous. Ah. Uh. They've been told not to interact now. They interacted too much. And then Baldy got hold of it and said, don't talk no more. Uh, well, guys, I think that's pretty much it, isn't it? Yeah. Have a lovely day. See you later. Thank you very much. Hopefully, you, yep, have a look at the birds. They're lovely, aren't they? <laughs> All right, guys, that's it. Lord of Audits here, guys. Jibs Audit signing out. Crazy place.